Well, good morning, everyone. I hope that uh, you are off to a great start this morning. As I told you yesterday, we'll be back in Deuteronomy again today and maybe even tomorrow. It really depends on how far we get today, but I just wanted to encourage you. Yesterday was the mandate to live the principles and the commands of the Word of God personally. And today I'm going to come through some of the same verses that we did yesterday, but I'm going to point out to you the mandate to teach them to others beginning with our own family and so so watch this i'm going to start with verse number two it says uh or actually i'll just do verse number one it says now these are the commandments the statutes and the judgments which the lord your god commanded to, to teach you that ye might do them in the land whither ye go to possess it listen to this that thou mayest fear the lord thy god to keep all his statute statutes and his commands and i command thee listen which i command thee thou and thy son and thy son's son all the days of thy life that thy days may be prolonged okay so then then the next several verses are all about the personal responsibility to live as an example and then the the next uh, verse we go to is verse number six it says in these words which i command thee this day shall be in thine heart and thou shalt teach them diligently unto thy children. Now listen to how you're going to do that. And thou shalt talk of them when thou sittest in thine house, and when thou walkest by the way, and when thou liest down, and when thou risest up. And thou shalt bind them uh, for a sign upon thy hand, and they shall be as frontlets between thine eyes. And thou shalt write them on the posts of thy house and on thy gates. And so, so think about this. He's not saying that we have to have posters all over the house uh, that have Bible verses and commands and that, that we have uh, the, the commands dangling from, our, from, our, the, uh, from our, our hair in front of our eyes or that we put things to where all we see is the Word of God. He's saying that we need to live the principles of the Word of God so completely that it's like being written all over everything. When our television comes on, it's written there. What we watch, what we listen to, what we read, uh, what we speak, what we, what we talk about, um, who we talk about, and why we talk about it. I mean, there's just so many variables because that's how we teach our children. We don't send them off to be taught by somebody else who doesn't love them the way we do. We do this ourselves. So I want to encourage you today, whether you have your own children or you're around other people's children, be an example they can follow of godliness. Not just being nice, not just being considered that nice person uh, that lives next door or that nice teacher they have, but that you live the principles of the Word of God. That's the mandate. And so I want to encourage you today that if you'll live out the principles of the people around you, We'll see, we'll see a beautiful example of who God is and what he can do. And so I want to encourage you to that today. Have a shining bright testimony wherever you are, beginning in your own home with your own children. And then let it go out from there. I hope you have a great day today.